Good day guys, Ping here. Um, today uh, we're going to model some of these patterns. Okay, so let's start. So this is a file uh, we did yesterday. So on the left hand side, so that's just some basic uh, normal wall, roof and floor. And on the right hand side, uh, we have a mess and then place some um, uh, wall by face roof by face okay so uh, first I'm going to show you so it should be the same so either this one or this one so I'm going to just uh, model it here okay so this pattern so first I'm going to show this pattern and and also there will be a different way to model it so so uh, the first method is just use curtain wall okay so I'll select this wall and I'll change this to a just uh, so this storefront okay so that's fine I'll just on joint now I'll see if I can attach to top uh, looks like we have some issue here mm maybe we need to so see here looks like this is the issue so what i'm going to do is Control z change it back to this wall and uh, instead of before i change it to curtain wall i'll change this location line out to wall center so this way when i change it to a, a, a curtain wall it will still see under this roof okay so now this is the curtain wall so what I'm going to do is I'll create a new uh, type okay so I'll call it um, new new pattern okay so and I'll keep all these size internal and bo uh, border modern type and what we're going to do is I'll change this to fix um, fix distance and fix distance both I'm going to use uh, 450 450 by 450 and OK and OK so now what we need to do is tab tab see this dash line so tab so this is the select it this is the curtain wall grid okay so and then go edit remove segment and now you just need to manually so click 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 and you will see Revit will remove part of grid line for you okay so and then escape select this grid uh, add remove segment so this time you can check you can pick this two three four five six seven so um, this is uh, a manual way to do it it's if 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 your um, patterns very you know small only small area so you can use this it's very simple straightforward but if you have a big wall of this pattern and this is quite time consuming so okay so so this is this is it okay and um, of course if, if you like for example like this one maybe I don't want to use this because this is too, uh, too yeah take too too much time so what I'm going to do is so I'll, sh I'll actually um, the, the next method so we will need a mess but uh, it's okay we can still use so we can very easily create a mass face okay so model in place mass 
and we just need to set work plan. I'll pick this wall as a work plan, and then draw some pick some um, reference line on this wall. So one, two, three, and four. So now we have this four reference line, and we just need to create a form. Oh hell, something's not right here. Something's not right. Control Z because it's not a loop. So we just need to trim it. TR trim. Okay, trim. And then let's let's check it again. So see, it's all uh m. See this circle, little empty circle, means it, they are all um connect to each other. Okay, so now we can create form. Now this time we will have two options. One is solid, one is face. We just need a face. Or I'll just create this face. Okay, and then what we need to do is we need to select this face. So select this face and divide surface. Um, looks like it's a parallel. It's um, parallel to that edge, but that's fine. We can always rotate it. Okay, so we can always rotate it. So for another ten, close eleven. Uh, yeah, let's pretend that's straight. Okay, so, and then we can go change the pattern. So for example, uh. Please ignore this. Uh, I just have, have had a test before. Okay, so just let's first just use this pattern, and uh, we just need to change the change the dimensions of change it to di fixed distance and fixed distance target in four fifty and four fifty. Okay, so looks like we need to rotate it. 90 degrees so our so 90 plus 11 that's 101 apply so that's the pattern but uh, if I'll just delete the wall maybe oh, oh sorry I'm in mass so finish mass and then let's just delete that wall there yeah I'll delete that wall this wall Okay, so now we have this mass phase here. So the next step, because if if we, um, for example, if we do a render, you will only see a face. You won't see these lines. So we need something there. So which is a uh, solid. So we just need to create a new uh, curtain panel pattern base family. Okay. So select this grid tile pattern grid change it to the first one and then we just need to uh, create a part of the part of the the volumes the frame okay so place one point draw on face I'll just place on this reference line and then Reference line rectangle draw on work plan set set work plan pick this work plan and draw a a profile of this volume and then I'll tap select one of the edge I'll change this to 50 and also select this edge change it to 150 and also I want to place this Oh hell, let me just change the scale. So yeah. Now I'll just move this to center. So now this select this um, profile and also tab select and the control select this edge and control select this edge and control select this edge create a form. Okay? And now let's load this into hang on which one? Ah, please ignore this. This will be uh, tomorrow's. Okay, so let's load this into family a uh, project four. So load this into project four. And now select this face. 
oh sorry edit in place and then select this face and change this to family I believe it's seven so we just did this and you will see this is it so instead of manually do that so you can just very quickly create a face with this pattern okay and if you zoom in you will see there's some line there so oh hell because I, I didn't show so I I turn off the show edge in on the shade shaded style so but if I check this you will see there's some line there um, see this um, yeah I don't think we can avoid these lines we can reduce the, these line but uh, there's there will always be lines there so and the only way I can hide these lines just uncheck the show edge okay so that's it uh, I'll quickly show you so because this is a, a mess I'll quickly show you how to place use that one on here so select this mess edit in place in the tab select this face create divide surface and change or oh not hell change this to this 450 fixed distance change this to fixed distance 450 and then just use that family 7 and that's it so I believe this is easier faster than this method okay so that's it and tom tomorrow um, we will have a look of this part and we will model this use use uh, same uh, similar method of this so curtain panel pattern base okay so thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow thank you bye